Hello guys, how are you? It's Judge here from Unis Gamers and I have a tutorial for you guys on how to install Minecraft uh, Minecraft's Mine Colony So, <clears throat> what you want to do is download it, I'll have a link in the description somewhere down there somewhere and what you want to do is you want to download it like I said and you'll have two files one will be Mine Colony and one will be Mod Loader um, I've renamed these myself because um, I think it looks neater if you just rename them and call them what they are. So, when you've got them, you want to unzip them inside, like, a, put them in a folder so it's neat. So you want to unzip them like so. And then you'll have two folders like that, with loads of random files in. When you've got that, you want to open a new finder window. And you want to go to your user, click on library, application support, Minecraft. And then you'll have a little area here. Now I'll, ex I'll explain these really quickly. Texture packs. This is where you put zip files for your texture packs inside. If you want like a tutorial on this, I've got one on my channel. These are all your save files. So this is world one, two, three, four. This is what you actually play on. So let's say if you wanted to um, send someone your worlds, you would compress this and you'll send it as a zip file, and then someone can open it and put it in there. Resources. I'm not sure what's meant to be in here. I'm sure there's something meant to be in there, but I don't have it. Um, bin. And last login, sorry, this is this keeps details of your login. Options, this just options really. So yeah, that's pretty much it. And in inside bin you want to open this and you want to click on Minecraft.jar, right click it and click open with archive utility. Now what this does is it makes a new folder for it. So inside this folder you see loads of class files and some folders, and this is where you want to put all of these. So where you've got mod loader, you want to copy all these files here and you want to drag them into the new Minecraft folder you just made. Click apply to all and replace all the files. And then it should be good to go. So we don't need this mod folder, mod loader folder anymore. So next we've got mine colony. Now you want to put all of these in except from GUI and mob. Oh, and by the way, to select all of the uh, files, you do command A and that will select all. And then to exclude files from being selected, you hold down command and you click which ones you don't want. So I want to put everything in except from the two folders. So put them in like that. And then you'll have GUI left and mob. So we want to put the folders inside GUI in here, inside the GUI folder in here. So if we scroll down and look for GUI, here we go, here's a GUI folder. You want to get these two and put them inside of there. Okay, so we don't need the GUI anymore. So mob, you want to find the mob folder in here. L M M. There we go. And you want to put these files inside of there. And then delete that folder. Well, delete that because you don't need it anymore. And while you're at M, you want to scroll up and you'll see a file called meta-inf. You want to delete this file. If you don't delete this, you'll be having problems with Minecraft. So now you want to go back here where it says minecraft.jar. You want to rename that minecraft.backup.jar and you want to name this folder minecraft.jar because what that does is minecraft reads the minecraft.jar folder and if that's still called minecraft.jar and that's just called minecraft it won't read any changes you've done so you want to name that minecraft.jar okay then you want to x out of there and x out of here i would recommend to keep these just in case anything goes wrong then open up minecraft and you shouldn't have any problems. If you have any problems here, then uh, I I can't help because I'm not complete. I'm not one of them guys who knows everything. So if you go into your world, you go inside your little house. And this is how you make your little guys. So to make a lumberjack, you get some wood and you make like an O shape with it. It has to be refined wood. And you could click to make a chest, but you don't want to do that. So let's say if I want to make a miner. I put a pickaxe in the middle, and then you click this, and you put these down. So you take these down. Oh, oh, sheep! And you take these, and then you put that on the ground, and a miner will spawn. Oh Jesus! One minute. Let me just put my headphones in. Actually, do you know what? I just muted my laptop. So let's say if you want a farmer, you put a hoe in the middle, and it makes a farmer. If you want a lumberjack, you put that in the middle and it makes lumberjacks. Or if you want a delivery man, you put a chest in the middle and it makes a delivery man. And yeah, that's actually pretty much it. So 
I hope this helped you guys. Um, please leave a comment saying if it helped or not. And I I love feedback, um, so it's always well appreciated. And oh, by the way, if you're having problems with this, okay, you want to exit Minecraft. And you want to close it down. Go back into library, application support, Minecraft. And then inside of here, if you're having problems with any mod or Minecraft, if you're having problems with anything Minecraft related, you want to go into your Minecraft thing from Applications Part Minecraft, and you want to delete everything inside of there, except from saves, texture packs, and last login. Delete everything but them three, okay? And then what happens is, when you next load up Minecraft, it will you log in. It will re-download everything for you. So that means you start from scratch again, but you've still got your worlds and your texture packs. So that's just a little tip if you're having any problems with it, okay? So I hope this helped you guys. Uh, make sure to comment and subscribe. And if you're not following me already, you should go check out my Minecraft adventures. Um, we're on episode 24 now, I think, and it's going pretty well. And for all you who are watching my Minecraft adventures, I've like put loads of um, annotations on saying next episode and previous episode to help you guys out. It took me about an hour to go through every single video and doing it. So I hope it helps you guys, and I'll see you guys later. I hope you have an awesome day, and I hope this has helped you. See you guys in a bit.